Blake Heron, a former child actor best known for his role of Marty Preston in the 1996 film Shiloh, was found dead on Friday morning. He was 35 years old. According to TMZ and other outlets, Heron's body was discovered by his girlfriend inside the actor's Los Angeles area home. After a call to 911 was placed, paramedics reportedly spent 40 minutes trying to revive Heron, but it was too late and he was pronounced dead at the scene. The Los Angeles Sheriff's Department tells E. News that the aforementioned call came in around 7.05 a.m. regarding an unidentified man who was not breathing. In the ensuing hours, Heron's rep confirmed Blake's passing to multiple websites and television stations. Heron had been sick for the past few days and had also battled a heroin addiction. He just completed a stint in rehab mere days ago. TMZ writes that responders did not find illegal drugs or evidence that alcohol had been consumed. Prescriptions for the flu were found at the scene, but it's unclear at the moment whether anything Heron ingested contributed to his death. Following Shiloh, Heron landed bit roles in movies and television projects, including We Were Soldiers, Boston Public and 1114. He recently co-starred in A Thousand Junkies which premiered at Tribeca Film Festival in 2017. I started doing drugs when I was about 12, typical smoking weed at first and drinking and whatnot. It quickly progressed, Heron said this past April, adding at the time, I lost everything. I lost my career, I lost all of my money, I lost possessions, and most importantly, I lost myself. I felt like I lost my soul. Our thoughts go out to the loved ones of Blake Heron. May he rest in peace. Here's a look, meanwhile, at other celebrities who have also passed away in 2017. May they all rest in peace. For more videos subscribe my YouTube channel.